Thank you for joining me on another Three Minute Thursday. And today I wanna to talk to you a little bit about uh, prepping and being sustainable with the seeds that you have, which is very easy to do because when you plant something, it's gonna produce, it has a way of producing seeds. And you can always use those seeds to make plants from plants. So what I did today, and you can see there's some moisture in this bag, this is cone flowers, and um, I have collected these seeds, and I have some wax paper that I'm gonna lay out and let those dry. And I also got marigolds, and it has rained a whole lot today, and you can see that there's moisture in this bag too. So those will also dry as well. Now yesterday, I went out and got, here it is, my carrot seed. So this is carrot seed and um, I collected those as well. There's all kinds of things that I have that I have collected. Basil, um, there's a whole nother pack of carrots. Um, this is going to be parsley. This is parsley. This is lettuce. Um, and then I have all these right here. This is more marigolds, more lettuce, more parsley, stem broccoli, dill seed, zucchini. This is tomato variety. It's just a bunch of different tomatoes all put together. Mustard greens. Now I do hope to get a little bit more detailed next year on labeling what tomato is what, just so we can keep up with those better. But the whole point of this video is to be able to be not only is it more cost effective, uh, saving money on your homestead by going and getting your own seeds, but it's also a way of being more self-sufficient. And, um, you know, that's important because our days are so uncertain now. And for our homestead, we don't want to be like your normal, typical um, farmers who depend on, you um, people to provide us seeds. So it has been our goal this year to learn how certain things go to seed and get those seeds so that we can be different from your conventional farmers. We can also save money on our homestead by doing that. And also that by doing all of that, it makes us more self-sufficient and we're able to make plants from plants and we're not dependent on somebody else. Happy homesteading y'all.